Hello everybody and welcome back to Tack and the Power of Juju. Um last time I said we were going to Dry Rock Canyon and here we are. Sorry this episode's taken a bit to get up. Um I've had a lot going on. And especially this past weekend. So to make up for it, I'll try to do a bunch of episodes this week. See if I can catch myself up. Thankfully, fall break is pretty soon. So, I may be able to record more episodes then. Oh crap, forgot the sheep. I'm gonna leave the sheep up here. Since we have the other one down here already. Aw, poor thing's blackened. Feel so bad for it. By the way, I've fixed my setup a bit. Oh, there's your normal. I've fixed my setup a bit so I can hear the sound now, although not very well. And I think I've fixed the buzzing problem. Sweet. Not by actually fixing the buzzing itself, but by turning the volume up really loud and just hoping that it'll mask it. So we'll see how this turns out. And like I said, next week's fall break, so I'll be at home with the system that I'm used to working with. And hopefully things will be better. See, I haven't played this game in a while. Give me just a second. I'm gonna to see if I can get my uh, computer closer to where my mouth is. There, that's better. It should pick up my voice a lot better now. So, thank you for blowing up in my face. We're gonna head up here. And, you remember this was closed in before? Now it's open and we can jump down in. So we get, if I can actually grab it. Come on. Why do they make this thing so hard to get? Ooh, good one. You just found a longer life juju spell. Now you can battle the nobles longer before needing to be healed. Oh yeah. So there, we got two things really quickly. Normal and that juju spell. Makes it a lot harder for us to die. There's always a good thing. Yeah, this, this bottom area was all sealed in. And it brings us up here. By this wonderful looking temple. We'll be getting back to that in a bit. Actually... I think we'll be getting back to that right now, actually. Pop over this wall. It, here's the, sh the shrine. So, somewhere around here... There's gotta be a tiki. Pretty sure you can leap over these walls. Maybe not. Okay, so I guess I do have to go up. But you can leap on over and onto this wall. Not that getting up there really does anything. This is where you need the sheep. 
Now, I told you last time that we were here, it took an alternate path. Well, that you can take an alternate path to get up here. This is that alternate path. This takes you that same... Give me the sheep. Don't kill me while I'm throwing sheep. That was entirely too complicated. Anyway, now that we've got the sheep up there, we can get across here. Unfortunately, we don't have a sheep for that one. And that's that ram that I said that we had to get past if we were gonna... Ow. If we were gonna get over there. So, you remember last time this was sealed in. <clears throat> now it's not. Let me see if I can get it from here. So I'm pretty sure you can get up there from here. You just have to hit jump at the right moment. I hate the jumping out of the water thing. <clears throat> I'm not going down the waterfall yet. I know you can get it from this angle. I've done it before. <clears throat> oh well. There's a way to get it from the other angle too. And if we absolutely needed to, we could get back here. The level's not that stupid. So we head up here on some interestingly placed statues. There's a tiki over there, but if you remember, there was a yorbel back here. Midair switch for the win. We're almost half, or, well, I guess a quarter of the way there. <clears throat> Remember that there's 200 Yorbles total in the game. Pop up here and get the Tiki. Sweet. Woo! Over there's another Yorbel, so we'll be heading that direction. That almost worked. Oh, and I think you can get behind here. Yeah. We'll be coming back here later. You saw when we were passing that, it said something about activating it. Yeah, that'll be just a bit later. There's enough stuff that we can do here now that's worth coming. Over there, I forget exactly how you get to it. But we have to go there at some point. Actually, that might be that later part. I don't precisely remember it. Anywho, let's get back up to where we were and take a sheep with us to get past that ram. Take out this marble first. Who's the man? Do, do I even have to get past this room? No, I don't, because I already got that. Okay, now we just need to figure out how to get over to the uh, far side. You can't quite jump up there, I'm pretty sure. No, maybe you can jump up there. Ah, so yeah, that's how you get back up. And now, you might have noticed we haven't gotten all the Yorbles here yet. I don't specifically know where they are. <laughs> Most of my Yorbel collecting is just going around randomly, hoping to get lucky.
So that's what we're gonna be doing. If it takes too long, I promise I'll cut ahead. But... I've already been there. Thank you for telling me the way that I've already gone several times. You're very, very incredibly useful. Run! Thankfully, we don't have to worry about nurples anymore. We've got our trusty spirit rattle. Come on, there's gotta be a Yorble somewhere around here. Oh, there's one. Perfect timing. And there's one up there, too. Even better. Ah, almost. Oh, this is how you get over there. Right? Right? I know you can get over this wall. You might have to do it from the other angle. So back over there we go. <clears throat> Sorry that I don't really know what I'm doing. Nervalist. Thankfully, we aren't any really worse to wear for it. Now, where were we before? We're over oh, we were over there. Which means we get to go back down here. Don't you love backtracking? So do I. Can you run? Mr. Ram, if you would oblige. Thank you. So we'll head back over this direction where we were before. And hopefully this time we'll actually get those Yorbles. a lot easier. Now. Oh, I think I remember the part that comes next. I think I can just drop down now, but might as well swing the rope over. Or if not, whatever, whatever works. But anyway, we've got this rhino. We'll get to it in just a second. Oh. Hey, free life. Thank you. See that sign? That's what we get next. We're gonna break as many of these walls as possible. Hey, Yorble on the fly. We're gonna be doing a lot of that. Run over as many of these nests as possible, too. Slow down a bit here. And hey, we got an ostrich. But I'm not going to be using him in just yet. Because I still want to break down all of those doors. And these nests. It'll just make our lives a lot easier. Thank you. Now that's done. We'll be riding ostrich for a while. Now, you saw how the rhino controlled when I was hitting it. The ostrich controls like that always. The entire time. So it's a bit complicated to use. And we'll be collecting Yorbles on the way. So the ostrich takes a bit of getting used to. Come on, ostrich. Get back here. I need to ride you. 
you might actually need to use the crazy feet juju to catch up with it because it, it's fairly fast even when it's not running for its life I need to corner it. There we go. And we already ran into a wall. See, that's why we wanted to remove all the walls. Right, okay. Get back here, you. Corner you. Got him there. Come on, you stupid bird, let me ride you. Maybe if I just walk up really slow. I know that there's a technique to getting these things. Seriously, like, not even touching the joystick right now. Come on. Screw it. may not be the way that you're supposed to, but hey, if it works, it works. So, now we've got our ostrich. Crap, dead end. Hey, sweet, I'm still on it. Controls! So yeah, now we've got the ostrich. Now we need to take him up that little tiny slope and collect the orbals along our way. They really decided to torture you. Orbal number one. At least got here. You need the you need the ostrich's jump to get through these though. You're not quite you can't jump quite far enough. Otherwise. Oh, that's what you do. That's right. You hit the ostrich to make it stick its head in the sand, and then you can grab it. Completely forgot about that. to doing this for a long time. Can I double jump with this thing? No, I can just single jump. Yeah, this is how we'll get the last couple Yorbles. Hey, we made it on the platform, and we missed the Yorble? Okay. Teach Nurbles the meaning of pain from long distance because this power up allows you to shoot fire acorns from your blowgun. So, yeah, that's a wonderful power up to get, but we still have to keep doing this over and over again until we get all of those Yorbles. Thankfully, we only missed a couple. So, this should just take me one more complete round. Yeah, the ostrich controls are a bit touchy. Oh, come on. Seriously, get down here, ostrich. It's still up there. Oh, there it is. Let's go. One more time. Yeah, 
it, it's really, it, it takes some getting used to. But once you've got the controls down, it's just a matter of getting the jumps timed right. Missed it again. Okay, so I think that's the last Yorble in the level, though. So once we get that one, we can move on to the next part. Which is the fun part. And that wasn't the last Yorble in the level. Well, that sucks. Where is the last one? Well, anyway, I can get off this stupid ostrich. backwards? No. I'm gonna actually have to check my guide for this one, guys. Just give me a moment. Okay, so it looks like I probably missed one in the second part. So I'll be getting back over there. By the second part, I mean uh, that area that we went to past the uh, waterfall. So if I can... If I can get back there soon, I won't cut, but if it takes me too long, I'll cut ahead. Might as well use crazy feet. Because it's not. Actually, there's also a possibility that the other one could be over here. So I'm just gonna quickly check. Come on, Ram. said the second magic Mubu plant, and I'm not sure which one it means. It probably meant that one. Oh. Duh. There's the orbital right up here. And that's not it. Crap, I missed more than one normal. So the other one's gotta be over the uh, bridge. Because it's down there somewhere. I'm pretty sure it's not. So hey guys, uh, here's the Yorble that I was missing. It's okay, that's all the Yorbles here. We should try it's not else. over the waterfall. I'll cut that part out. So yeah, completely forgot about that one. Anyway, looks like we're about out of time for this episode. Next time, well, hey, yeah, why not? I'll show you this time. summon the juju so we can get to the next level. Jujus, remember Gazelda the Gargantua? Oh, baby. Oh, yeah. Ladies love Taffy, even though he is so white. Yeah. Um, oh, back, okay. Tag Galag, party uh -huh. ten. Forget the list. Will you just open this door? Oh, wait is a minute. Is there a um, What did you say your name was again? <sighs> Tack. T-A-K. Oh, uh, here it is. Tack, party of one. Congratulations, you're on the list, man! Well then, we'll open the door for you. Mr. Cat, party of one. Hey, he just took off. I don't know. Same thing that happens every time we open this door. So yeah, guys. Next time we'll be doing this level. I've watched Loth train here before. This is a dangerous place. You need to be careful. Those lights are your only way to see, and you have to follow them through these caves. 
Don't get too far behind the light or the nurbles will get us. So yeah guys, um next time we'll be exploring Dry Rock Caverns, which is incredibly fun. I think that's a normal right above, right above me. Nope, never mind, that's just that thing. We'll be getting to that later. Anyway, hope you all enjoyed this. Hope it came out well. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.